Hey guys, I thought I'd pop on and do a review of the January edition of Lovely Beauty. It looks like this. They are um, redesigning their boxes, so this one is not the one that you will get if you pay for it. Um, but uh, yeah, they're redesigning their boxes and coming up with a whole new design for that. So that would be kind of interesting to see, we'll probably see that next month. So, I'm really happy with this box. If you don't know about Lovely Beauty, I'll put the link down below. It's £10 a month plus postage and packing, and you get a choice of three menus every month. So. Even though it's not a complete surprise, um, there will be something in there that you definitely like because you picked it beforehand. So, I'm very happy with this box, very, very happy. I'm going to start with the first product that I'm super happy with. I'm wearing it today. This is the, um, I think this is the most expensive thing in this box. It's the Cosmetics A La Car, I believe it's called the Divine Lash, yes it is, Divine Lash Mascara. And it looks like this, this is the box. I have it on today, if I get a little bit closer you might be able to see. And I put it on with, I didn't wear any eyeliner today because I really wanted to see what it was like. And as you can see, pretty impressive. That's just like one coat. You can build it up and build it up. I wore it yesterday and built it up quite a lot. It's fantastic. And uh, this is 23 pounds. And you just never know the mascaras. If you have the high-end mascaras, it doesn't always mean they're going to work for you. But this is phenomenal. I love it. It looks like they're so classy. And the wonderful thing about this that's kind of unusual is the wand. It is a plastic wand, but it's tiny, tiny, and it's tapered at the end. It's fantastic. It really gets right to the root of the lash, which I have a problem with sometimes with the bigger brushes. I think they don't really get right to the root of the lash. You kind of get like a little gap um, between the root of the lash and the rest of your lashes but this is just perfect for getting right into the roots and for underneath on the lower lash line I love this mascara absolute complete favorite so that's fantastic the next thing that I love which I didn't think I would like as much as I do because me and hair care products we're kind of a little bit we have a love-hate relationship um, what's going on with this piece of hair um, and I didn't I thought well you know I like to try it, so let's see. This is the Purology uh, Serious Color Care Color Stylist Silk Bodifying Volumizing Mousse. <sighs> Looks like this. This is, how big is this? Uh, 65 mil. The full size is um, 250. This is lovely. Usually, if I put mousse in my hair or any kind of product in my hair, my hair has a complete fit. Um, but this is wonderful. You put it on dry hair, just put it on the roots to the ends. Fantastic stuff. It's really given it a lot of body, which is what I kind of struggle with with my hair. So, thumbs up for that. That's fantastic. The next product. Um, this isn't the shade I picked actually, but they did say in the menus that they would vary, but it's still a very nice colour. This is a NYX Single Eyeshadow, looks like this, and actually if I thought I could have worn this today, but anyway. Um, and this one is in Super Creamy. Uh, the one I picked was in Sahara, but I didn't get sent that one. Um, and I think they do three different variations of the shades you can get for this. Um, so this looks like this. It is, it's kind of like, um, it's like a pale gold, but it does have some silver shimmer in it. I don't know how well it would translate on the eye. I'm not sure. I think maybe the shimmer, like the glitter would fall out a little bit too much, but I will see. It's it's a nice color. It's not the shade that I picked, the box, but there we go. That's what that looks like. That's super creamy, kind of a pale yellow gold with some glitter in it. Another product. This is kind of cool. I think I may put this in like my kitchen or something. This is by um, Aran um, Aromatics, and this is their Witch Germ Vitamin E Vegetable Soap. Full size bar. Um, doesn't really smell of anything, but I'm sure when you kind of open it, it probably smells quite nice. Um, I love Aran Aromatics. I remember they used to do a gel body oil with um, minute, still, uh, minute gold glitter particles in it, and it smelled of myrrh, and I just, oh my god. I wish, I don't think they still make it, it's such a shame. But um, yeah, so that was from kind of like when I was 10, um, and I love that stuff, so it kind of has a special place in my heart, Aran Aromatics. But anyway, nice bar of soap, you can always use soap, right? And then the last product, which I love, I love. Um, this is the Anatomical Gina Blooming Shower uh, Rose Body Cleanser. Looks like this, Mahusive, as usual, with all anatomical things. This one is three pounds full size. Such a good bargain, right? And it does actually smell like rose. You know when they say things smell like rose and you're like, mm, no, they don't really. This actually does, it's fantastic. So, mm, it smells gorgeous. Just smells like rose petals. So that is a um, 
shower gel I can always use those so I am very impressed oh it also gets a little, little card with that I'm very impressed with the January edition of Love Me Beauty I think they've really outdone themselves love the product love the fact that you get a full size high end mascara that's fantastic so I'm very very impressed with the January edition so I will leave a link to it down below in case you're interested in signing up um, I think they're definitely worth um, kind of looking into if you want a sampling subscription service because you get to choose so there's bound to be something bound to be something that you would like in the box because you already know what's in it but it's still a surprise because you wouldn't have tried everything before so i hope you enjoyed that guys hope it was helpful and i will see you all very very soon Bye -bye.